Well, they've got quite a racket going. The first round of Olympic tennis kicks off this Sunday. We've gathered, gathered the entire U.S. Olympic tennis team and their coaches, Zena Garrison and Patrick McEnroe, for a quick preview. Good morning. Hi, you guys. How are you? Good morning, Katie. Right. Nice to have you. Thank you for coming by. Zena, why don't you first introduce the women. The women. First <laughs> Martina told me that ladies is an opinion, women is a fact. <laughs> Martina always knows best. So first we have Venus Williams, we have Chanda Rubin, Martina Navratilova, and Lisa Raymond. Welcome you guys and Patrick. We got the twins here, Bob Bryan, Bob Beads, remember that Katie, Mike <laughs> Bryan, Andy Roddick, Marty Fish, Taylor Dent, and Vince Spady on the end. Well, tonight, welcome to you guys, too. Vince had a funny little riff, which I'll ask him to do a little bit later, Vince. <laughs> Let me start with Zena. How are you going to do now that Serena and Jennifer uh, Capriati have both pulled out due to injuries? Well, unfortunately, they're both not here, but I mean, have a great team. Everybody's excited to be here. We had a wonderful day yesterday, and um, they had a good practice this morning. Good. Oh, there's the sun. I was missing <laughs> it, weren't you? No. Yeah. Venus, tell me, I'm, a lot has changed in four years how confident are you that you can hold on to a gold medal in women's singles i know um i'm not taking for granted my last olympics and it was wonderful a great experience and i've just got to add to it i feel good and um, can't wait to start are you sad about serena i am and if i talk about it too much i get a little a little sad but i'm determined to enjoy it without her and i enjoy it you know more with her but at the same time she's always in my thoughts meanwhile i know that that chanda is now going to be your doubles partner right. right chanda now have you and venus ever played together before we haven't and i think both of us haven't probably played doubles in about a year so <laughs> it's will be exciting we're really getting geared up and we're working hard on the practice court and how hard is that to get used to a new doubles partner in such a short amount of time Time. Well, I've played with different people. I don't. I can't really speak for Venus. She's usually played with Serena, so I'm sure it's going to be very tough for her. But I think you know, being here at the Olympics, it's exciting anyway. So you know, you do what you have to do, and you go out and enjoy it. Meanwhile, Martina, these are your first Olympic Games. Yeah, well, you got to do it sometime. <laughs> yeah, you are uh, 47. I can say that because so am I. Oh, cool. Yeah, and and tell me Sisters. why you decided to make your Olympic debut here in Athens. Well, 88 uh, was a little burned out at the time, and then the other times I couldn't play for one reason or another. So I'm just excited that I get the opportunity. And I want to thank my partner, Lisa Raymond, for asking me last year because I never really thought about playing this year. And then Lisa said, how about the Olympics next year? I said, OK. We, we so admire, it's Lisa's fault. Well, we'll get to Lisa in two seconds. We admire you so much, Martina, for, you know, having the endurance to keep going. Do you feel yourself slowing down at all? Oh, yes, uh, absolutely. <laughs> You're supposed <laughs> to say no, uh, not at all, Katie. <laughs> no, I have slowed down. I mean, I don't I don't run as fast. Uh, I try. The effort's there, but, uh, you know, the result's not quite the same. But I'm still, I still feel pretty, uh, pretty fit, and uh, I still feel I can get to most balls, so it's okay. Meanwhile, Lisa, you found out on your birthday, I understand, when you turned 31, you were taking Jennifer Capriati's place in the singles yes. competition. Were you psyched about that? It was definitely an early birthday present. Uh, you know, Zena gave me the call. Um, she called me the day before my birthday just to kind of give me a heads up. And then uh, I got the go ahead on my birthday uh, right before, actually, before we got on the flight. So it was a very nice birthday present for me. Are you excited to be here in Athens? Oh, this is this is unbelievable. I mean, we all flew in yesterday and we were oh, all. Oh, you must be exhausted. Well, no, I mean, we were so tired, but yet at the same time, we were just all just bright and just just so stoked to be here and you know I know that Andy and Marty spent uh, the night last night and walking around the village and just kind of you know chatting with people and this is just amazing yeah meanwhile I know Bob and Mike you guys we don't have Venus and Serena playing doubles this year but we do have you the twins how does this uh, does this make the competition does it give you a competitive edge because somebody's saying is that Bob or is that Mike or who did that I mean you are identical twins does it yeah no it, it definitely helps I mean we've played thousands of matches together and uh, you know a lot of these countries are just kind of patching together a team and you know we play together every week so uh, you know we're feeling good I mean the Williams won the gold medal so we kind of have a lot to live up to but uh, you know we'll try our best yeah now are you, it is it Bob or Mike Bob Bob, Bob. Bob. Mike is, is your family coming at all uh, actually they discourage family members from coming just because of the tight security and it, you know it's really tough to get back we actually bought our personal coach and he just got a badge yesterday so you know, the security is pretty tight, but um, it told us not to worry about it. It's focused on the tennis. Yeah, and I'm sure they'll be watching you at home. Hi, Andy, in those cool shades. Oh, you're, looking, cool. you're looking strong. I know you're the best U.S. hope for a medal here in Athens. Are you feeling a lot of pressure, Andy? Oh, I don't know about that. I mean, we have some pretty accomplished players here, but uh, I'm not feeling any pressure. I'm just happy to be here, you know, and I'm, I'm just trying to enjoy the whole Olympic experience. I know you've been very outspoken about the importance of representing the United States here in Athens. Yeah. Why is that? 
Well, I think it's a sports ultimate honor to be asked to represent your country, and I, I think all of us really appreciate it. We were all talking about it yesterday, and as Lisa said, you know, we were we were dead tired from jet lag, and we all kind of wanted to get out and see what it was all about. So, uh, you know, we're having a good time here. And meanwhile, Marty, I know that you're playing with Andy, and you're also playing in the singles competition, right? Yeah, Andy and I have played a, a bunch of, of doubles together over the years. We've known each other for a long time. What about the heat? I was chatting with Martina about this earlier. I know that. The, the competition starts at 10 and 5 and then moves to just 5. Are you guys worried about playing in this heat or are you so used to it it doesn't bother you? Well, I'm, I live in Tampa right now and I've lived in Florida my entire <laughs> life, so this is really nothing right now for, for us. And, and Vince, is, Vince is from Florida as well. Meanwhile, I mean, <laughs> oh my God, I was going to say, you guys in those jackets, you're crazy. You are definitely baking. I was going to, you're going to be losing like five pounds in this segment alone. Meanwhile, Taylor Dent, is this different than, than, than playing at any other international tennis event? Because this is your first Olympics. Yeah, no, this is my first Olympics, and I, I think, you know, I guess it's different for every player, but my opinion is it is definitely different. Uh, this comes once every four years, and it's the biggest uh, sports arena, you know, at, at this time of year and, you know, for the next four years. Right. So it's really a chance to go out and represent your country well and uh, hopefully play the best tennis you can and uh, with a little bit of luck pull home a medal. Well, good luck to you, and, and I know your cousin's Misty May of yeah. Beach Volleyball, which That's is cool. cool. And finally, we have Vince. Vince, what's up? Vince. How are you? Word. Word. What a better theme than being on the Olympic team. It's like a dream. We got the Brian's Fish Dent and, of course, me. But first, this is today on NBC. We love you, Katie. Well, say, say what you told me when you, when you introduced yourself. Excuse me? Tell me what, tell them what you told me. Oh, I said, hello, Katie. My name is Vince Spady. I, got, I drive a Mercedes, and I might be crazy and a little shady, but you know what? We're here and we're the Grady. And you're my lady. <laughs> anyway, it's great to have you guys. I want you to get out of the sun before you pass out. Get some rest. Good luck. Uh, and the tennis starts this weekend, right? Yes. So, Martina, I'm going to warm up, warm you up on Saturday morning. You and I are hitting some balls together. <laughs> hey. Yeah, that's all right. You're, you're speaking the truth. Thanks, you guys, so much. Thank it's you. great to have you. And we'll be back in a moment. This is Today on NBC.